More than 500 pounds of litter was collected from local beaches last year along Lake Michigan. Emily Deem is in Manitowoc to explain. Hi, Em. Hey, good morning. Area residents are asked to come and help clean up 11 different beaches along Lake Michigan. And this morning, we are actually at Red Arrow Beach in Manitowoc. I have Kim and Wendy here with me. They are a part of the Friends of the Manitowoc River Watershed. Ladies, you started it. Kim, what are you all about? Good morning. Uh, we are all about making sure we get to our youth, educating them on what happens on our city beaches and our river, and we're out to try to do whatever we can to keep it clean, clean and healthy. Yeah, you know, you can see the beach right behind us, beautiful Lake Michigan, but it's not just the beach. If you take a look down here, look at all of these cigarette butts that are just right here, right when you come into the park area. Yes, uh, we last year on just our September cleanup alone collected 6,000 cigarette butts. Unbelievable. Well, look at all this that I have right below our feet here. This is what we found on the beach already this morning. Um, why don't you kind of tell me a little bit, Wendy, what this is? Because this would be washed up from Lake Michigan, right? Yep, that's a, a type of netting, um, bottles, human, anything that's man-made is basically what we try and pick up. Uh, we have a checklist that we use, so as we pick up litter, we're tallying how much of each kind of man-made item we're finding. You look at styrofoam like that, that's never going to break down. That's just going to keep washing up. The netting is terrible for the fish and the birds. Um, and, and, you know, not to mention just all of the, the plastic and the aluminum waste, all of these things that just never going to break down and make, make our beaches ugly and unhealthy for humans and animals. Now, this cleanup is going to be Saturday. April 20th, uh, and last year you had a pretty successful year, right? Because you had two different cleanups. Right, we had two cleanups last year. Our first one is in April, and we had 127 people at that cleanup. Uh, it wasn't well advertised because it was the first time we did it, but then our September cleanup, we had 179 people, and we collected over 360 pounds of garbage. Unbelievable. And you know, really great that it coincides with Earth Day. So if you want to learn more, go to our website, fox11online.com, click on Good Day Wisconsin. Kim, Wendy, thank you for being with us. We'll send it back to you.